Hey guys, apparently I'm still awake, but I did take my medication. There's bed. I don't know if you can hear it be purring. <laughs> it's kind of low. But yay, Ryan just brought out another video, so I'm gonna go watch it and have it smoke and then go to bed. You know, my crush. <laughs> Okay, so there is still one crush that I have, but she, that's pretty cool he's joining the army. So there's Bud. <laughs> My Bud. Hey, boy. <laughs> Look at his buzz. Sorry, it's a dirk. <laughs> <coughs> Show you guys his paws. Okay, he's right where my head is. <laughs> you bet. <laughs> I love his paw. I love his purr. Do you hear it? <laughs> Are you purring? So cute. So let me know if you guys could hear that or not. <laughs> but yay, Bud's purring. I mean, he's probably always purring, I just never heard it. But I finally heard him purr. Hey, bud. You're my boy. <laughs> the only boy for me is bed. The crush is just a crush. <laughs> <clears throat> like I keep saying, it's fine to have crushes, but... Anything more? Nope. <laughs> Get head long and nails are. <laughs> One day I gotta chop them off. Well, not chop them off, but get them. <laughs> <laughs> you guys hear that? I could hear it and I'm deaf right now. <laughs> Although I'm like literally right on top of them so I can hear them. Hey there, bud. You're so cute. Hey, bud. You're so cute. You're so cute. <laughs> they spoil him rotten. Oh, I was gonna make it so short, but <laughs> it went past a minute. So yeah, let me know if you guys could hear the uh him purring or not. I had the phone right up to him so you could hear him. But yeah, I love his purr and his meow. I have two two lights on, three lights on. It's still dark, so but yeah, I'm medicated. <laughs> well, I don't know if I'm gonna end up going to the doctors today, but I am gonna set my alarm and try to get up early. But considering that, even though I just took my medication before midnight. I'm still awake. <laughs> I had the minties. 
Sad the munchies, the munchies. And I need a smoke. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Like I said, if I don't go to the doctors today, it's not the end of the world. I could just make it another day, another appointment. And then just go shopping close by. I might actually want to do that because I'm like, what's really the point of going to the doctors when I'm still on medication? And I still can't hear anything. I just, that's all that they're going to say. And this is why I end up doing my test that I got to do at home. But if I don't wake up in time to do it, <clears throat> so I don't have the vlogging kit in, I probably should have used my new, the newer phone. But I just grabbed this phone because it was closer to me. So, yeah. We'll see. But I really don't feel like going to the doctor now. <laughs> I've been taking the medication. But... Uh, if it worse comes to worse and I missed the appointment, I'll just reschedule for next week. They know my conditions and everything. So I think that's another reason too why I decided to wait on dying the path. Because I'm like, just in case if I don't get up tomorrow before my appointment. Because it's like, I'd have to leave by noon to get there on time. Which at this point, I don't think I'll even get up until like 1 o'clock. Because so. <clears throat> it's like 2 o'clock now, I think. Yeah, 2.30, July 24th. So, sorry I don't have my vlogging kit in, but I don't think I'll be going to the doctors. But, like I said, I just took my uh, medication twice. And then I just started start today, and then I started eating. And then, like I said, I was just so tired. But... Road Ryan's video came on, so I was like watching that. So now I need to go for a smoke and have to watch it with headphones on because I could only hear part of what he was saying. <laughs> but I know he dropped out of NYC and he's going to the army now. So I'm like, yeah, that's so cool. Because I actually used to, my uncle was actually a sergeant in the army. And I actually wanted to go to the army because they had um, a radio program, but it was too small. <laughs> obviously to go so I'm like yeah that's pretty cool but like I said even though I have a crush on him that's all it is it's just a crush I'm not interested in dating anyone <laughs> unless if he wanted to then that would be a different story but like I said he's like twice my age so probably not <laughs> Probably not, but I was like, I think he hasn't been on YouTube because he had a girlfriend, and you know, it just turns out that he couldn't figure out what he wanted to do with his life, <laughs> which I kind of get, because in my 20s, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. I've changed my career so many times, and then it all goes from my, medic from my conditions. Like I said, first I wanted to be a coroner, but I couldn't be a coroner because of my disabilities. And you need to know a lot, and then my memory sucks. <laughs> then I wanted to be an empire, couldn't be an empire, because I wasn't, didn't have good eyesight, and I didn't have the proper body weight. Then I wanted to be <laughs> a broadcaster, so I actually did go to broadcasting school and got a diploma in broadcasting for my grade 12. Which is surprising, that there's like no money unless if you... Travel and sometimes I wonder what would have happened if I went to Williams Lake and took that job, but I'm kind of glad now that I didn't go somewhere because then I would have been all by myself and I would have been screwed. <laughs> so, and then I had the cats at the time, so yes, I was like, no, can't move to Williams Lake. 
and it would have been nice though, but no, I stayed because of the cats, and then all the cats passed away, and then I was like, ooh, now I could travel the world, and I could go anywhere, and then no, I ended up getting all these conditions, and I was like, oh, so what else am I going to do with my life? I'm going to get me a cat, bud, <laughs> name bud, so dreams change. So it's very, very normal. Oh, and I forgot to mention I did backstage theater for like two years. No schooling in that. Just volunteered. And I did a radio, like you guys know. I was very popular with the local scene, still am. But yeah, I like my life now as much as I can't get out and. I don't have a social life, and I can't be, and I can't do this, and I can't do that. I got bud. <laughs> I got me bud. <laughs> hey, bud. He's <laughs> doing that with his face. So I got bud, and then I got uh, always something to do. I'm always busy, so that's what I'm like. If I don't end up going to the doctor's appointment today, then I'll just go shopping close by, and... Um, what do you call it? Finish the vegan side and the soup, and most likely I probably yeah, I'm gonna just sleep till whenever. <laughs> and I'll just call the doctors tomorrow. Be like he, or be like yeah. When I wake up, yeah, I slept in again. <laughs> they know my conditions. So, I need the washroom, so there's bed, so I'm still awake, unfortunately, but I'm pretty much just going out for a smoke, and then watch Ryan Chi, and go to bed. And most likely, I'm staying home. Oh, because it's like 2.30, and I'm still not asleep yet. So... Talk to you guys later. Here on Fat Stories, going for a smoke. There's bed. <laughs>